now I'm watching this and I, I kept thinking of, you know, movies with the time like Run, Lilla, Run. Or how did that, was it always the idea to let's put this a timer on this character and he has to find these people? How early did that come about in creating this? I think that that was baked into the concept from the start. The, I mean, the, the core concept of the movie is very graphic and robust and, and was always there when I, uh, Joe and Anthony Russo first, I, I guess when they bought the spec and came, came to me with it, it was, you know, it was a manhunt movie in a lockdown Manhattan that takes place over the course of one night. And obviously when, the, when, when business opens, the city has to open. So, and essentially the, the, the idea being that the, you know, once the city opens, the, the killers will be in the wind. So nice. Now, how how involved were Joe and Anthony with this process? Pretty significantly. I mean, they kind of they sort of set the table for everything. By they 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 bought the script. They attached me to it. They introduced me to Chadwick, and then we sort of had we had space to run with it ourselves for a while, whilst we kind of refined the story and pushed it on to the next level. But they were always available in terms of. Uh, you know, ideas and questions, and they also provided a sort of, you know, great access to other actors when we started to cast the movie. They were incredibly useful and helpful in that, and, you know, having done some amazing action work, they were, you know, it was kind of a bit like being a film school uh, with, you know, their sort of help and advice and that. And then, I, and then f again, as we got onto post, it was just the, the constant interrogation of the material in the most helpful way. And it's like, how can we make this better? How, how can we elevate it further? How can we make it more cinematic? But always within a, and, and I think the other thing is within a context of making sure that the best idea always won. There was no ego involved. There was no, uh, you know, there was no sort of uh, rank or seniority. It was, it was just always about let's tell the best story in the best way. Well, that's kind of impressive because you have this, like you said, you, this cast mm -hmm. is amazing, and there was no ego or no. That's what. How, who was a dream catch for you? Was, was there a certain actor that you're like, oh yeah, and we got him? Was it, it, Chad? it was Chadwick, yeah, because he was he really was our first and only choice in terms of like when we, and the it felt it, it felt imp it just felt improbable. It happened very quickly, you know. Uh, we had we did a little bit of work on the script to make it to, to make the concept clear and to, so that he would understand immediately what we were asking him to engage with. And then Joe and Anthony, you know, you send a script out to an actor, it can take weeks to get a read. When Joe and Anthony send it out, it takes a couple of days, and then you 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 kind of get to meet pretty quickly after that. And and the, it really this. The process of making the film was a little bit like the experience of watching it, and in, in that it, it went like an express train. But it all, but all of that really started with Chadwick, and that was a sort of like a declaration of intent in terms of quality. And then we were able to, you know, pull other people in and 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 build up and out from there. Now, do you see this as like? I mean, obviously, you this could be a continuation. You could co continue with Twenty Two Bridges. You know, do you think? Did you think that when you were filming? This? No, we didn't. We because the because you're really watching a character come to life and 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 sort of stress testing the story as rigorously as you possibly can at every point and and not getting too far ahead. Yeah. You know, you you kind of build the house brick by brick and you know hope that. It, it, it looks good enough for people to want to come and sit in at the end. What is going on here? I just need the truth, that's all. They told me you were fearless. The guy who kills cop killers. Sees his dad and every cop who dies. Nobody approaching? He's mine! Out of the way, move! They're not gonna escape this island. You're the only cop tonight who speaks first and shoots second. I will find out why the night happened. Rep the set, yeah. Gotta rep the set. Dang.